Well, like wildlife experts with endangered species, arts coordinators in the Bakersfield City School District are trying to preserve a rare breed within their schools, trombone players. Last year, they noticed fewer students choosing the trombone, so today the district declared the day Trombone Day, hoping to slide some more interest the instrument's way. <laughs> trying to breathe new life into the horn. The Bakersfield City School District held Trombone Day at Sequoia Middle School. We had 160 plus kids today. The trombone's not out there in popular culture like it would have been 50 years ago. We thought we would have a special day to feature the trombone. Here we go. Robert Soto, professor of trombone at Fullerton College, led the two-hour clinic. Showing the range of fun and hoping to stretch the reach this brass horn has among students. The whole focus for today is really educating all these young kids and promoting the trombone and trying to get more kids to want to play the instrument in band. Trombone's an essential part of a great band and orchestra. You've got to have a lot of them to have a good sounding ensemble. Ready? Okay, we've still got some people doing this. Is that F? Here we go, big breath, ready? From beginners to those with more honed horn skills, students watch what this instrument could do, each piece with a purpose, and what puckering practice behind the brass could achieve. I just thought the trombone was unique because some instruments just have buttons. I saw the trombone just slides. I wanted to try that for once. I don't want to let go. <laughs> I want to keep on playing. Opening these kids' eyes to a future in music that could blow future audiences away. I think in the future we'll probably see more trombone players because these kids will talk to other kids and uh, we have new crops of students every year. Please play it because it's a great instrument. And Stone says the reason students gave for not wanting to play the trombone were because, well, the case was too big, they were too expensive to rent, or they didn't know what a trombone is. But as you heard, Stone thinks today will change all of that. The clinic was put on with help from the Yamaha Corporation and Nick Rail Music.